Welcome back, friends. Last week, we started looking at this book. Do you remember what this book is? That's right, the Bible. The Bible has two sections. The Old Testament tells us of God's promise. He is to be our God and to provide a rescue plan for us. The New Testament shows us the promise coming true. The rescuer comes. The first four books of the New Testament are called the Gospels. Gospel means good news. Jesus has close friends who learned from him. Their names are Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, and they wrote the books that make up the Gospels. In these books, they tell us the story of Jesus coming to earth to be our Savior. That is good news. John 3.16 is found in the book of John, which is one of the Gospels. Let's stand up and say it together. Are you ready? For God so loved the world that he gave his only son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Great job. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John all walked with Jesus. They tell the story of Jesus's life on earth as they saw it because they were there to witness it. We can divide the gospel story into three parts. It begins with Jesus's birth. The middle section is li Jesus living a sinless and perfect life. The last section of the gospels tell us about Jesus dying and rising from the dead. The gospels remind us that God loved us so much that he sent his son to be our rescuer. He took the punishment for our sins. That is a story you find in the Gospels. It is a story of God's rescue. The Gospels tell us about Jesus's life on earth, but that's not the end of the story or the end of the Bible. Next week, we will look at God's plan. Let's pray and thank God for sending his son to rescue us. Can you show me your prayer hands? God, we come before you today and we are just so thankful that you love us no matter what and that you had a plan from the very beginning to send your son to rescue us and save us from our sin. We love you and we hope that we learn more about you each and every day when we read our Bible. In your name we pray. Amen. All right, guys, we'll see you next time.